Hey, good morning, folks. Uh, it's Papa. Uh, this video here is just me and these little guys. And uh, Gigi and Kim, very beginning of this video, there's a little bit of Gigi still here. She's on her way out the door. And Roman was giving her something to laugh about for her trip. And they have went on a little small uh three day trip i think it's three days i don't know when they get back <laughs> I, i'm in charge me and heidi well we have to share that with out people outside people like i have and he's in charge there how did i in charge in here except when connor and lex show up and then they become in charge and uh then i have a friend here little little kippy and kim's little guy uh oh he's a tired baby girl a boy little boy i'm around heidi so much i think everybody, everything's a girl uh lex and connor spent the night last night they're a lot of fun they are and i watched tv and they played all through the house and stuff and they was very good about not wrecking the house Gigi says, the house is clean. I hope it's going to be clean when I get back. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know about that because you leave a bunch of little old puppies here and cats and little boys. They're, they're fun. They go back and forth between here and Lester's. A lot of fun, a lot of company. And uh, I watched some old movies last night that I hadn't seen in a long time. Uh, with John Wayne movies, you know, some of the old ones, uh, in harm's way and stuff like that. Had a lot, of, it was a nice evening. I, uh, made breakfast this morning. You'll see that on this video for the boys. And when they get up, they're up kind of late. Uh, me and Heidi went to bed midnight-ish, I guess, midnight-ish. But anyway, uh, I hope you enjoy this video. It's, it's not real long, uh, I came in, I came in from doing my chores and Roman looked very guilty. And the first thing I looked at was that bird cage. There's only one bird in that cage. It's supposed to be two. Well, the little bird was up on the cabin. That little cage has multiple doors, multiple. And even the big door in the front which we've had to put a uh, bread tie on it to keep it from opening because it's easy to open. It's got a little door inside it, and we didn't think about that little door, and evidently, Roman playing with it, the little bird got out. He didn't hurt the bird. He just sitting there looking around like, I didn't mean to, Papa, I didn't mean to. Little bird was fine. I think he's missing a tail feather. <laughs> but he's back in there, and they're fine. I'll probably get in trouble for that, but I'm not going to tell Gigi. Now, she may watch this video and find out, but if she don't, I'm not saying a word. Great experiences here. I hope you all enjoy this little video. i got to get outside and take care of some chores as soon as I finish my last cup of coffee. I love you guys. Take care. What are you doing, Roman? That's not for you. It's for the babies. You're not a baby. I don't know, Roman. I'm thinking. I'm thinking there's something wrong with you. I think there's something wrong with Roman. Got it going. You got, got the little music going and everything. Oh, this would be my toy, Papa. This can be my toy, no. Them kids have to find something else, Papa. This is mine. 
No. Those are not yours. Those are not yours. So he's tired. Looks like it's nap time. Heidi's not quite ready for her nap. She said, I'm thinking about it, Papa. My hair's pretty much back to normal color, right? Your hair looks good, baby. It's not that bright red no more. Yeah, yeah I'm a lot happier with this. And I'll be babysitting one of Kim's, maybe two of Kim's little dogs. Well, she and him are going on a little road trip. Seems like I'll have a lot of company here. She wants to play, but her play partner's asleep. Are we missing a key? Uh. No, we should only have three. Should be three keys. You need to take. You'd let, your key and two new ones. Huh? So I'm using your key. I mean, I was. So I give this one the key. I'm getting my last minute instructions. The house is clean, she said, so evidently that means I got to keep it clean. Uh, all the trash cans, she said, have been emptied, so that means I have to keep them emptied. No, that means, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So they're going to go down. I'm ready. Spend a few days. My hair's. Back to normal color. Back to normal, that's good. I have a blue shirt, blue Crocs. I can't see you, Crocs. Oh, yeah, there's Crocs, your Crocs. Oh, yeah, blue. yeah, you, you match, you look good. Yeah, we're ready. Y'all have fun. Kind of hot in the house, or either I'm getting a little nervous. Yeah, you probably just been going all morning. Yeah. It's cool in there. So. Yeah, that bed there at Rowan's end belongs to Kim's little dog that she's going to leave here. What's his name? Jensen. Jensen. Yeah. And she brought a kennel for him because he's used to a kennel at night. Kippy sleeps with me at night, so yeah, I don't Yeah, Kippy know sleeps in the bed with you. But Kippy's already tried to pull the puppy pad out of the... Yeah, there's her kennel over here with a puppy kennel. pad. Yeah. And he's tried to pull it out and because... we tried puppy pads with him, but him and the cat... Him and little Macy Fair like to much. play with it. So I've been trying. He sleeps in the bed all night. I go out with him before bed and then take him out first thing in the morning. So yeah, he does real good. He's well, pretty good. He, he doesn't really know because he's just walking around playing and he just stops and pees. Like, oh, well, that's why we I have. don't want to spank him right now. I just, yeah, that shampooer, you do I a know. good job with it. I know. <laughs> As long as I ain't got to do it. And we can't have to get her just in another bed because Ron is taking that bed over. That's his. <laughs> I don't know about Roman. All right, I'm ready. All right. She'll be already here. Wait, don't kill her to bring her puppy, then they're leaving. Well, little Macy has taken over Jensen's crate. Kim brought that crate down for Jensen to sleep in at night. And I put him in there last night when I went to bed. Lex and Connor were playing uh, games, and I told them they could not go outside, not open the doors for anyone. And I could hear, hear them playing. Anyway, if anybody came, Heidi, I guarantee you, would let me know. But anyway, so when I get up this morning, and I know when they come to bed, I, uh, when I got up this morning, one of those boys had let little Jensen out. And little girl there was in his bed. Door was open. Now, I know she didn't let him out. <laughs> I don't think. But she took over his bed. And she don't need his bed. Because there's two beds over here. Now, that is 
That bed <laughs> belongs to this little guy, little Kippy. And she normally sleeps in his bed. That bed also belongs to that Kim brought over for little Jensen when he's outside of the crate. But yesterday, Roman took it and kept it all day long. And Roman didn't go out until last night. And he likes to go out at night and prowl around. And then he'll come in and sleep all day. <laughs> anyway, she's taking this bed. Just as under the couch to sleep. Lost his bed. And she's daring him. Just daring him to come back in there. <laughs> all right. I'm making the boys breakfast right now. They, they're about to get up and I got to have it ready for them. Gigi and Kim having a good time in Levi. Uh, they got them a little beach house for the for a couple of days and trying to have a little road trip. And, and uh, they called yesterday evening and Levi was a little bit upset where they were at, didn't have internet. And he was very upset. I think they were able to finally get the TV working uh, in the little cabin. So at least he had TV. All right. Well, I'm babysitting Kim's little Jensen. That's him. And she's just a little kippy. <laughs> and Rowan, Rowan just wants someone to try it. Just come on, boys, try it. And little Macy over there says, y'all better leave me alone, too. I got big brother Roman here. Now, I'm going to be babysitting these guys for three nights. And I guarantee you, it's going to be a chore. It's going to be a chore, Roman. Macy, Kippy, <laughs> I ain't gonna tolerate it. I'm not tolerating it, Popo. They better leave me alone. <laughs> Kippy's a little bit darker. He got a little thing in his forehead, a little spot on his forehead. Jensen, a little bit lighter colored. Besides, that's the look you smell like. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. It's on now. now. I'm not gonna let y'all double team her. Y'all not gonna double team that baby. She can hold her own on one. But the thing is, she gets tired of them. She get up on top of the couch and they can't get her. Rome said, I'm here, Papa, in case she needs me. I'll work them over. <laughs> uh, I'm making breakfast for these boys. And uh, I just started. But look at this bacon. This little thing she just got offline. There's a little top. Put your bacon, just lay your bacon in there. Put the lid on it. It's microwavable. That's what it's for. And uh, I put like four slices in there. And let's see. Then I just go to like three minutes, okay? And it comes out perfect. Look at that. Perfect. That's a pretty neat little thing. Uh, she got it for me for, for the boys because it's a lot quicker than putting it in a skillet. Now, if I'm cooking a complete breakfast, I and I'm going to do eggs and all that, then I'll do a skillet because, you know, it don't matter. Or I can do the bacon in this thing too. But 
Lex, I uh, only wanted biscuits and bacon, and that's what Connor wanted, just biscuits, some bacon, and orange juice. So this is the quickest way to do. I can have all the bacon done by the time the biscuits are ready. And it's a good breakfast, and it don't take long. Three minutes, and it's going to come out like that. Very good. Very good. All right. Just wanted to show you that. One of my little shortcuts that Gigi got for me. <laughs> All right, there, bro. Bacon is done. Beautiful bacon. And the good thing about this little thing, and I'm not trying to sell this thing. <laughs> I'm going to be able to save all my bacon grease for when I'm cooking and I want some bacon grease. And I'll just take it and put it in the freezer and let it freeze. And I'll dip out what I need to and heat it up when I want it. So, anyway, now I'll do their biscuits, pour up their orange juice in their cups, and when they get up, their breakfast will be ready. And as soon as I get this done, I'll go on out and start doing my chores with Ivan and all of his friends. <laughs> all right, folks, I'm going to cut this off now. Hope y'all have a good day.